By the time Evan was nine, his parents had died in a horrific and sudden fire. The only thing that remained of them was a packet of cornflakes. Evan moved in with his grandpa George, who hadn't left his study since the accident, and developed a severe obsession with golden flakes of corn. By the time he was 17, Evan's life was completely consumed. Everything he ate contained some form of cornflakes, boiled, baked, crushed, diced, sliced, pickled, powdered and pulverized. One day, as he and Reuben sat at school, he found one hiding in his right ear. This was the same day that everything changed. This is Olive. She's new. Hi, Reuben. Oh. What an incredible pleasure it is to meet you, Evan. I'm Olive. I've just moved here from Dublin. Evan's world was suddenly torn wide open. Life had never felt so clear or so far away. He was in love with Olive from the first word he heard her say. Olive, you've made the day so incredibly beautiful. Why don't you show me around? Show me around. Are you okay? No, I didn't mean what I said. I'm never going to see you again. Evan was in love, wholly and completely, but he knew that Olive would be horrified by his odd obsession and had suddenly realised that he had a choice to make. It was either Olive or Golden Flakes of Corn. There was no reality he could fathom with both. Evan vowed never to see Olive or anyone else ever again. He would commit his life entirely to Corn Flakes and lock himself in the kitchen. Grandpa George could feel a heavy heart lying silently in the house. His compulsive hand broke away from the keyboard and leaving his study for the first time in eight years, he stood in the kitchen doorway. Olive. Please. I'm so sorry. Evan. I'm sorry. I talk- No. Please. Let me explain. It was clear to Evan in that moment that there was, in fact, such a world where love and cornflakes could coexist quite happily. <laughs> 